वेल हाई गाइज दिस इज अनिकेत एंड वी आर बैक विथ वन मोर वीडियो गाइज आज का जो वीडियो है वो बेस्ड है एप्लीकेशन ऑफ इंटीग्रल्स एरिया अंडर कर्व्स के ऊपर तो गाइज कुछ अर्जे पहले हमने एप्लीकेशन ऑफ इंटीग्रल्स एरिया अंडर कर्व्स के ऊपर कुछ शॉर्टकट्स एंड ट्रिक्स शेयर किए थे इस चैनल के ऊपर तो अगर आपने वो सारे शॉर्टकट्स एंड ट्रिक्स नहीं देखे तो आई रिक्वेस्ट यू टू गो एंड वॉच दैट वीडियो फर्स्ट एंड नोट डाउन ऑल द इम्पोर्ट शॉर्टकट्स एंड ट्रिक्स दैट वी है बिकॉज आज के वीडियो में We are going to discuss some important questions and how to apply all those shortcuts onto these questions. So, chaliye without wasting much time, let's quickly get started. All right, guys. So here we go. The first question of the day is: the area of the region bounded by the curves y is equal to x square and x is equal to y square is. और तो यहाँ पे टू फाइंड एरिया बिटवीन टू पैराबोलास एंड वी हैव अ शॉर्टकट टू फाइंड एरिया बिटवीन टू पैराबोलास तो चलिए लेट्स अप्लाई दैट शॉर्टकट एंड सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन ऑल सो हियर द गिवन इक्वेशंस आर वाई इज इक्वल टू एक्स स्क्वायर एंड एक्स इज इक्वल टू वाई स्क्वायर एंड नाउ लेट्स क्विकली रीअरेंज दिस इक्वेश दिस विल बी वाई स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू एक्स विच इज दिस इक्वेशन एंड We have x square is equal to y, which is this equation. And the reason why we have written these equations like this is because now we can compare these equations with our standard equations. And we all know the standard equations of parabolas are y square is equal to 4ax, and the next one is x square is equal to 4by. And now, if we compare the given equations of parabolas with our standard equations, we can get the values of a and b. So, therefore, यहाँ पे 4a is equal to it is one here. So, therefore, a is equal to one by four. Similarly, 4b is equal to one here. So, 4b is equal to one, and therefore, b is equal to again one by four. And now we can apply the shortcut. We know The area between two parabolas y square is equal to 4ax and x square is equal to 4by is given by 16ab upon 3. And now let's quickly put the values of a and b in the shortcut. So this will be 16a is 1 by 4 into b is again 1 by 4. This is upon 3. So now this 4 into 4 is 16, and this 16 will get cancelled with the above 16. So what we have is one by three square units. One by three square units. So option A is the right answer. All right, and now the next one is area bounded by the curves satisfying the conditions x square upon twenty five plus y square upon thirty six less than equal to one less than equal to x upon five plus y upon six is given by. All right, guys. So here we have to find area between and ellipse and a straight line. So chaliye, let's apply our shortcut and solve this question. All right. And now here the equations are x square upon twenty five plus y square upon thirty six is equal to one, and x upon five plus y upon six is equal to one. Okay, so these are the two equations that we have. Now let's again compare these equations with our standard equations. The standard equation of an ellipse is x square upon a square plus y square upon b square is equal to one, and that of a straight line is x upon a plus y upon b is equal to one. And now from here we can get the values of a and b. So देखना यहाँ पे For ellipse, a square is equal to twenty-five, so therefore we can say a is equal to five. Similarly, b square is equal to thirty-six, so b is equal to six. You can check the values from the equation of line as well. The way up a is equal to five and b is equal to six, which is what we have got. And now the shortcut to find the area between an ellipse and a straight line is. 1 by 4 pi ab minus 1 by 2 ab, right? So, chaliye. Now let's use this formula and put the values. So, therefore, this will be 
वन बाय फोर पाए ए इज फाइव एंड बी इज सिक्स माइनस दिस इज वन बाय टू ए इज फाइव एंड बी इज सिक्स सो ऑन सॉल्विंग दिस दिस विल बी टू टू जा दिस इज टू थ्री जा एंड हियर दिस इज टू वन जा दिस इज टू थ्री जा सो देर फोर दिस विल बी दिस इज फाइव थ्री जा फिफ्टीन सो वी हैव फिफ्टीन पाए अपॉन टू हियर माइनस दिस इज फाइव थ्री जा फिफ्टीन and now guys if i take 15 by 2 common here from both the terms then what i'll get is this is pi minus here it will be 2 right so 15 by 2 into pi minus 2 is the right answer which is option d here okay and now the next one area bounded by the ellipse x square upon 4 plus y square upon 9 is equal to 1 is given by एंड एरिया ऑफ एन एलिप्स फाइंड करने के लिए भी वी हैव अ शॉर्ट एंड सिंपल फॉर्मुला तो चलिए लेट्स अप्लाई दैट फॉर्मुला एंड सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन ऑल राइट एंड नाउ हियर द इक्वेशन ऑफ एलिप्स इज एक्स स्क्वायर अपॉन फोर प्लस वाई स्क्वायर अपॉन नाइन इज इक्वल टू वन एंड नाउ इफ यू कंपेयर दिस गिवन इक्वेशन ऑफ एलिप्स विद अवर स्टैंडर्ड इक्वेशन वी कैन स्टेट अवे मेक आउट द वैल्यूज ऑफ ए एंड बी विल बी ए विल बी टू एंड बी विल बी Three, right? Since a square is four here and b square is nine, and we all know the shortcut to find area of an ellipse, it is given by pi a b. So therefore, our answer will be pi a is two and b is three. So therefore, it is six pi. So six pi square units is the answer, which is option A here. All right, and now the last one is area included between the two curves y square is equal to 4ax and x square equal to 4ay is given by. All right, guys. So, ये जो क्वेश्चन है, ये काफी फेमस क्वेश्चन है and काफी बार एक रिपीट हो चुका है अलग-अलग कॉम्पिटिटिव एग्जाम्स में. But anyways, let's apply our shortcut and get this one solved. All right, guys. So here the given equations of parabolas are y square is equal to 4ax and x square. Is equal to four a y, and now let's write down our standard equations of parabolas below these equations. So our standard equations of parabolas are y square is equal to four a x, and x square is equal to four b y. ठीक है? And we know the shortcut to find the areas between these two parabolas: y square is equal to four a x, and x square is equal to four b y. It is sixteen AB upon three, right? So guys, यहाँ पे इन दोनों equations में देखो सब कुछ same है. सिर्फ यहाँ पे this B is replaced by A here. So similarly, what we are going to do is in the shortcut formula as well, we are just going to replace this B by A here. So therefore, it will be sixteen A and जहाँ पर B है वहाँ पे again we write A here upon three. And now therefore, this will be 16 a square upon 3 square units which is option d here and that's it and that's all we have this video guys aaj ke video mein bas itna hi in the next video i'm going to cover up more shortcuts and tricks from application of integrals and many more topics to abhi tak agar aapne subscribe nahi kiya to please subscribe kar lijiye kahi kuch miss na ho jaye and main milta hu aapko agle video mein till then Goodbye and take care